In this video, we will see how to trace obstacles on a roof or near a roof. So over here, if I will look closely, I can see there are some mummies on this roof. So I have already traced this roof. You can see that in 3D. But I have not traced the obstacles yet. So I'll go back and now I'll show how to trace these obstacles. For tracing these mummies, I will go to the model and take polygon tool. Then I will trace it in a similar fashion which I use to trace any RCC roof. I can also vary the height, tilt, azimuth, everything about this obstacle over here. Right? Similarly, if I have cylindrical obstacles like the water tanks over here, I can trace them using the cylinder tool over here. I'll take the cylinder, I'll zoom in and then I'll trace it. I can even put in an accurate radius for this water tank. For example, if it is one meter and it gets to one meter. And now I can copy this and paste on other parts of the roof. So I'll show it to you in 3D. So here you can see that the two obstacles which I traced are appearing on the roof. I'll go back. I can also trace a tree. For example, if we had a tree over here, I could go to the model, take the tree and then trace it. First, I'll trace its trunk, then I'll trace its crown. And I can also vary the trunk as well as crown height. I'll show this to you in 3D. So here, I've successfully added and traced all the obstacles on this roof.